Hey guys, welcome to Recombo. It's Basil here giving you a quick tour of the Samsung Galaxy S4 camera user interface. The S4 packs a 13 megapixel camera, but it isn't the pixels that make this thing impressive. We've seen 13 megapixels before. What makes it impressive are the modes that it's packed with. If we, for example, tap the mode toggle, we can see a Samsung Galaxy camera-like user interface pops up. You've got this tiled UI, which can be swapped out for a scrolling uh, list of options. Going back to the tiled UI, we can see the options being auto, beauty face, best photo, best face, sound shot, drama, animated photo, rich tone, also known as HDR, razor, panorama, sports, and night mode. Whew. Giving you a brief uh, explanation of each, sorry about that. Um, we can safely say auto just makes all the decisions for you. Beauty face will soften out any creases and wrinkles in your face. Best photo takes a bunch of photos and lets you pick the best one. Best face takes a bunch of photos, isolates the faces and lets you pick the best face. Sound in shot will actually take a single still, but also grab some audio around it. I think it's nine seconds of audio um, either side of the actual picture taken. So that brings your pictures to life. Drama mode will take a sequence shot and stitch the moving objects together. So for example, if we have a ballerina doing a pirouette, we can see her at various stages of the action. And jumping over to um, animated photo, that makes an element of your photo move. We've seen this in Nokia phones before. Um, it will actually create an animated GIF. So you can turn all your photos into crazy BuzzFeed type pictures, GIFs. Rich tone, HDR, nothing new there. High dynamic range, composites and overexposed, underexposed, and a well-exposed shot together to pull out the details from the blacks and from the whites. A razor means you can simply rub out a part of your uh, picture. The way that works is it takes a bunch of shots and composites apart from one shot into the shot that you want to go through with. Panorama takes a simple panorama. Sports take a, takes a shot really quickly. Night mode improves low light performance. Whew. There's also one feature which we haven't covered, and that's this one here. If we actually tap the front facing camera type icon here, we can see our video guy. This is Alpa right there, and this is my hand. If we wanted to take a picture of my hand and Alpa simultaneously, we can do so with Alpa waving. Now we jump through to that picture, we can share that picture, and we get much more in the shot. We get Alpa waving and we get my hand as well. Really smart stuff and it means that you can basically bring the photo taker and the photo subject into the same picture. So that has been a brief, brief um, example of what you can expect on the Samsung Galaxy S4 camera. If you've got any questions, please fire us a comment in the comment section below and we will do our best to answer them. If you've enjoyed this video, please click like. If you like our channel, click subscribe.